The International Climbers Festival is in full swing. People have been climbing in Lander for the last 30 years, and the Climbers Festival has been going on for 19 years. So there's this really strong history of climbing in Lander. Within an hour drive, you have every type of rock climbing. It's a logical place to have a festival like this. Friday's event goes until 11 o'clock at City Park. So there's games and competitions going on all night. So if people want to come, uh, we're going to have music, food, beverages, family fun. It's going to be an awesome time. But the Climbers Festival isn't only about climbing. So the events that we're doing here today aren't all just about climbing. We, you know, us as, as climbers, we, we have quirky little intricacies, and that's really what we're celebrating here today. Earlier tonight, these climbers had a chance to put their stomachs to the test. And the winner was 25-year-old Joseph Magelson from Casper. It feels really good to win, but it kind of feels like... I'll be sitting most of the night now, and most of most of the uh, food is going to hopefully stay there. I'm kind of nauseous. Along with crate stacking and tug of war, the climbers have a number of events to look forward to the rest of tonight and this weekend. In terms of tomorrow, it starts off early up at Wild Iris on South Pass, and that has a Wild Iris mountain trail run. Uh, that starts at 7 o'clock with pre-registration occurring before that. It's a really hard race. Then after that, we have educational clinics. Uh, a breakfast by Mountain Hardware and Wild Iris Mountain Sports. And then later in the day, we have an art opening of the late photographer Bobby Modell, and that's at the Lander Art Center. Then after the tribute to Bobby Modell at the Lander Art Center, we've got the keynote presentations with Royal Robbins, Kevin Jorgensen, Kate Rutherford at the Grand Theater. Hundreds of people travel to Lander just for the Climbers Festival. Each and every one of them have their own reason. The gathering of people and friends that I have here and I've met over the years of coming to the Climbers Comp. This is Victoria Fergoso reporting for County10.com.